Good day everyone, you're watching Rate You Fixes. On this video, I'm going to walk you through quick steps on how to fix the error message in case if you're not able to install Windows Update uh, 1903. Now, there might be an instance that uh, when you're trying to install Windows Update 1903, you might get an error message saying that Windows could not connect to update services. We'll try again later or you can check now. So for this error message, uh, the more likely the issue could be because of uh, uh, the various reason. One of the main um, uh, reason why you would get this error message is because uh, the Windows update services may not be running. The, so the first step, what I would suggest you to try to do is um, click on the search button at the top left corner of your screen and type services.msc. That should open up the uh, services app or you can click on the services app here. Now this will open up all the services which are running on the computer. So this is the window with which which would look like. And here you will have to look for Windows Update. So you will have to scroll down a bit at the bottom and look for Windows Update. Click on double click on this and uh, click on from the startup type select automatic. You may start stop it. Start it again. Click on apply and then click on OK and also look for Windows installer. Make sure it is running. So in case if it is not running, you will have to click on start. Click on apply and then click on OK. So once this is done, you may try installing Windows update uh, and see if that works. In case if these steps doesn't work, the next step, what I would suggest you to do is uh, check um, for your security software in case if you have a security software installed uh, in my case i have avira i would suggest you to go ahead and disable the security software uh, you can go to the uh, taskbar at the bottom right corner or it might be yeah more likely it would be at the bottom right corner unless you have changed the taskbar uh, view so you will have to do a right click on um, on any of the security software and in case if you see an option it says enable real-time protection or uh, you you can go ahead and uncheck that so various security software might have a various option so in my case I'm going to uncheck this box and uh, go ahead and uh, try installing updates now in case if this step doesn't work the next step what I would suggest you to do is to uh, change the DNS uh, settings you will have to change the DNS address manual. The domain name system plays a vital role to access internet service on your system. If it is, if this address is not correctly set, it can cause Windows Update temporarily unavailable. So what you will have to do is um, go to the search box. In the search box, go ahead and type run. Open the run window. In the run window, go ahead and type ncpa. I repeat it is ncpa.cpl click on ok so this should open up the network connection window here open up any of the network connection settings double click on this and uh, right click on it and go to properties once you open up the properties you will have to navigate to internet protocol version 4 tcp slash ipv4 select that double click on it and on the internet protocol version 4 on the second option which says obtain dns server address manually to change it uh, automatically we'll have to change it to use the following dns address manually so here you will have to go ahead and type the ips as um, as mentioned on this step and I will also mention this IP address in the video description. You can follow it from there. So it is 8.8.8. .8 .8. And uh, the alternate DNS server has to be 8.8.4.4. .4. And check the box which says validate settings upon exit then click on ok so once this is done what i would suggest you is close the window and try installing windows update 
now in case if this uh, see if it is if it works in case if this doesn't work the next step what I would suggest you is uh, try the first step again so what you will have to do here is uh, go back to the Windows services window that is um, go to the search and type run or you can type services dot msc open up the services window once you have the uh, services window open uh, what i would suggest you is check if the uh, windows update services has been enabled or it is running in case if it is not running or if it is stopped you will have to go ahead and uh, try uh, starting it again and also check for the windows installer now once this is done try installing the windows update and see if that works in case if you still um, having problem in installing updates the next step what I would suggest to is try installing Windows troubleshooter so in order to access the Windows troubleshooter what you will have to do is you will have to do a right click on it go to settings under settings you will have to go under a uh, Windows and security under Windows and security you will see an option which says troubleshoot under troubleshoot scroll down a bit here and look for windows update uh, so should be seeing it right here double click on it and click on run the troubleshooter so what this tool does is it try it is an inbuilt tool from microsoft it will try to fix the uh, windows updates in case if there are any issues it will go ahead and try to uh, try to fix the issue by itself and once this is uh, completed you may try to go ahead and uh, try installing the update so this is what you will have to do here so it might take some time so I would suggest you to be patient and um, here it is if you look for the view, uh, view more information in case if there are any issues you would see the error logs here click on next and click on close now try installing Windows update and see if that works in case if all the steps mentioned or doesn't work um, what I would suggest you is I would suggest you to go ahead and restart your computer and try installing Windows update again and see if that works in case if you still have a problem I would suggest you to leave me a comment in the comment section so that I can come up with a possible solution I hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day